Mmm. I just love watermelon. Mmm. It's really good. It's so juicy. Today, I'm here with my special guest, Anna. Hi. Anna is my cousin who's from Illinois. And today, we are going to show you how to draw a watermelon with oil pastel. All right, my cousin Anna and I are going to show you how to draw a watermelon with oil pastel today. Lucy left us, but hopefully she'll want to come back and draw with us today. And um, we are going to begin by choosing a green oil pastel. So go ahead and choose any color green from our oil pastels. I think I'm going to choose this green. Any color green. And we are going to start with the outside of... Is this a green? That's a green. Yep, that's a green of our watermelon. And what we're going to do, Anna, is we are going to draw the outside of our watermelon first. And this is what it's going to look like. It's going to look like a big open U. Okay? Like a smiley face kind of. Like a smiley face. Perfect. Like a smiley face. So watch. I'm going to start right here on my paper. I'm just going to do a big smiley face like that. Excellent. So go ahead and do your big smiley face. Excellent. Very nice. Now, what you're going to do is we're going to go ahead and do um, a little line across in like this from our smiley face. Okay. Just a little line coming straight in. And now I'm going to go to the end of that line and I'm going to do another smiley face connecting to the other line that we just drew. So it's going to look like this. No, it really looks like a smiley face. No, it really looks like a smiley face. Oh, I can't make it. All right. Now, that color doesn't really look that green, does it? No. Go ahead and try to use this lime green instead. All right, you don't have to go over it. Mm -hmm. Now we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna fill in the smiley face green and we're gonna try our best to stay within the lines and covering all of the black paper. This is going to be the outside of our watermelon. I just love eating watermelon in the summer. Yeah. When it's hot outside, if you're at the beach or on the boat, it's so nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that color is a lot better. <laughs> okay, so you're just going to color it in. I'm taking my time covering the black. We have a big green smiley face or wide U, I guess, but I like a smiley face. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, excellent, Anna. Now let's go ahead and put our green oil pastels away. And we're going to go ahead and take these red. You choose this red. Take that red and I'll take this red. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we are going to draw a red line connecting our green smiley face. But we want to make it look like someone took a bite out of our watermelon. So watch what Ms. Schumacher is going to do before you do it. I'm gonna draw a straight line like it's the top of the watermelon. And about right here, I'm gonna make a zigzag line to make it look like someone took a bite out of the watermelon. And I'm gonna keep drawing the line straight to connect it to my green smiley face. Excellent. 
excellent. So draw it straight across. And then you're gonna stop and do a, like someone took a bite out of your watermelon. And then bring it back up and then draw it straight across again. Now, I wanna make sure when I'm coloring in my watermelon that I do not go into the green. So I'm gonna go ahead and draw a red line next to the green to make sure that I do not cross this red line when I'm coloring in my watermelon. But you know what we need to do before we color in our watermelon? We have a black oil pastel I'm gonna show you. Go ahead and take your black oil pastel you know, we're gonna go ahead and share our black oil pastel. Okay. And I am going to draw little black seeds in my watermelon. Now, we're not gonna draw too many black seeds, just about six or seven, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and draw my black seeds. Now, Anna, go ahead and draw your black seeds. And we want to do this before we color in our watermelon with our red oil pastel. Remember, this is with a black oil pastel. All right, so now we're gonna put our black oil pastel away and we're gonna pick up our red oil pastel and we're gonna color in our watermelon, but we'll make sure to be very careful to not color over our black seeds. So you can even do like a little line around them to make sure that you don't color them in. Like a little safety line here. Okay, and then I'm gonna color in the rest of my watermelon red. And be careful not to go outside the lines. And just take our time. Excellent job, Anna. It's looking really good. It's looking just like a watermelon. Like the watermelon we were eating earlier. <laughs> it was really good. It was really good. Nice and juicy. Yep. <laughs> I'm gonna go get Lucy really fast. 
Because I feel like she's missing out on our drawing. Yeah, she's just sleeping on the chair. Here we go, Coralie. Right on the pesto. Okay. Oh, Lucy. oh, come on, Lucy. Stay with us. You need to learn how to use oil pastels. Yeah, Lucy. Okay, so go ahead and finish coloring that in. So when you're done coloring it in red, you can put your red away. And we're actually gonna take a pink, okay? So go ahead and grab a pink, there's a pink right there. And we're actually just gently and loosely, we're gonna kind of go over our red. You don't have to fill in the whole thing, just kind of gently and loosely. I'm just gonna kind of. Go over. Hey, Lucy. Lucy. We miss you. We want you to color with us. Yeah, Lucy. We want you to draw a watermelon. Okay, so go ahead and finish. Did you finish going over with the pink? I did a little. A little pink. Okay, excellent. And now we're gonna go ahead and put the pink away and we're gonna grab a yellow. So yellow and we're just gonna lightly do a few marks on our green like this, okay? Just lightly do a few marks on the green to get a bit some dimension. Okay. All right, now wait, wait, we see. are going to take the black and then again, we're gonna have to share. Uh-oh, Lucy, no, no, no. And now we're gonna go ahead oh. and we're going to outline our watermelon. So watch how I do this. I'm, gonna I'm going to outline the green smiley face or the outside of the watermelon. And then I'm going to take the black oil pastel and I'm going to draw a line in between the green and the red of the watermelon. And then I'm going to draw a line on top where the red is and I'm going to outline the bite that someone took out of my watermelon. And lastly, I am going to go over my black seeds one more time. Okay, Anna, so now you go ahead and trace around your watermelon with the black. Excellent. All right, go ahead and put the black away. Did you go over your seeds? Oh. Go over your seeds really fast. Now we're gonna go ahead and take our pink pastel again, and we're gonna write our name on the bottom corner, and then we are done with our oil pastel watermelon. What do you think? You like it? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna write Miss Shoe. Kind of write your name small if you can. So it's just in the bottom. And then we're gonna go ahead and put it up. And now we have our 
our oil pastel watermelon. Excellent job, Ian, that looks beautiful.